Hi guys! I wanted to do a quick review on the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. Um, it re revitalizes the hair, reconstructed for dry, reconstructed for dry damaged hair, and is an 8.5 jar. This thing was thirty dollars, so pretty pricey. But you do get a lot of um, product, and I've had it for about two months. I use it probably once a week, twice a week, and. I love this stuff. I just I just washed my hair and the way I, I do it I just um I have psoriasis so I have to use the I use Neutrogena T gel on my scalp and then I just let it let when I rinse it off I just let it go through my hair so I just put it on my scalp and then just let it go through my hair and just wash it off. I don't try to rub it too much because I have auburn hair looks a little orangey up here. I'm not sure why. It is it is reddish. And then I have my red ends. So I don't try to rub it too much. But I do... After I take that off, I put this on my hair. I leave it for maybe 7 to 10 minutes. Put my hair up. And then just... And I just put it from here down to, to um, concentrate on my ends because they get really dry and um, just massage it then I brush my hair through and I know a lot of people say don't brush your hair when it's wet but for some reason I have to I ha that's the only way I can un untangle my hair is it has to be wet it has to be with conditioner then I part it in two and then I gently just brush through it try not to break any hairs but just brush through it make sure that all the product is in between and it saturates all my hair. So then I just leave it, take care of the rest of me, take care of my face, my body shape, whatever I'm going to do. And then 7 10 minutes later, I wash it off. I don't completely take it off. So I wash it and then I squeeze, and then I wash and then squeeze. That's it. I put it up and dry it. I have the Turby, Turby towel, so I just leave it up soaking my hair, and then once um, I'm done putting on my clothes or whatever, then I take the Turby towel off, towel off, and then just brush through my hair. My hair is really dry and really poofy, like all the time, and for some reason, when I use this, it doesn't get poofy, and I love it, but... It's really soft. It makes my hair so soft and it smells so good. It has, um, it's really thick. See, nothing is falling. It's a little water because I, I just finished using it, but um, it's really, really thick. You see that? And it, see how long it takes to fall? That's how I like my conditioners. And it smells so good. And I only use it once or twice a week because it's really expensive. And I don't have $30 to spend all the time. So two months in, I still have still have probably like a third left quarter. Yeah, probably like a quarter. And um, I might buy it again just just because it really really makes my hair nice and soft and you could all you could also um use it as a leave-in conditioner just grab a little tiny dime size and then just put it through here i don't know about me using a dime size because i have a lot a lot of hair but just put a little bit leave it on your hair i don't do that because when i take it off when i take it off in the shower i just squeeze through it once twice and then just whatever it's in there i just leave it and i think that's why my hair stays so soft and why that's why it doesn't get like extra poofy i mean it does get a little poofy i do straighten it out um or curl it or whatever but lately i've just been leaving it like that or i put it up in a bun or something but i love this stuff and i just wanted to do a quick review on it because if you have hair like me thick um wavy 
damaged because I've dyed my hair so many times. I've bleached it, dyed it, bleached it, dyed it in less than six months. So I've been trying to get it back to normal. I've been trying not to do too much. I've been that's the reason why I haven't been trying to um, straighten it or curl it or use too much heat on it. So. I've been looking for products that I can just leave in my hair and it, it won't make my hair so poofy or make me look like a retard. So, my hair, I did cut my ends not too long ago. So, it's down right to my bra strap now. It was a little bit longer, but I had to. It was so damaged, I had to cut some of it. And right now it's drying. But see, like before, it, it would be so poofy right now. It's like just nice and soft so if you are thinking about getting it I suggest you save the money and try it out I'm not sure if they take if once you use the product you can return it I bought it at Ulta for $30 I'm not sure if you can return it but give it a shot maybe maybe you can it didn't work for you here maybe you can return it but try it out I recommend it it's really good it's been working on my hair and um, if you have the money and you want to splurge a little on your hair I feel like I bought so much crap that didn't work and it's five six dollars but everything adds up when you buy ten bottles of something that doesn't work for six dollars you've spent over fifty dollars right there so you might as well just buy something that's going to work and Save yourself another ten, twenty dollars, you know. So I, I stopped trying because I have so much crap. I, I have a Nexus, and this stuff is like freaking brand new and it's not cheap. I, I actually bought like the whole thing. I think each bottle was like ten, twelve dollars, and this shit, did, this, sorry, this did not work. And I have, oh my god, I have so much stuff up here. It's not even funny. It's insane the amount of product I have. I have this, um, Frizz Ease, uh, Secret Weapon Flawless Finishing Cream. This didn't work, and it's almost brand new. I bought it months ago. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, cause it didn't work. I have the Cantu Butter. That didn't work. I have. This is another product I use. Like I I use, not all the time, but I do like this um argan oil. One and only, you get it at Sally's. They have the whole line. And I, I like, they have a deep repair mask. I think it's uh, $10 on a, on a squeezy bottle like this one. Comes like this. The smaller bottle, 7 ounces, 8 ounces, like 10 bucks. That stuff I really like. That could almost compare to the Macadamia. And it's a lot cheaper. What else? I have... I, I've tried too much crap. Too much. Spend hundreds of dollars on things that don't work have it all here, don't know what to do with it, I need to start cleaning, it's spring cleaning so I'm starting to throw away a lot of my stuff but it's sad because I could have just bought something that did work, sometimes you think about it like is it going to be worth it spending $50, maybe I should just get this, it's only $6, it's going to work out, it doesn't work out, then you go and you buy something else and it doesn't work out, then you go and you buy something else and it doesn't work out, save your money, just buy something that's going to work and you'll be okay so this video went on a little long I just wanted to do a little review on the macadamia so um keep saying so but anyways this stuff works try it out if you're interested in the argan oil um I just finished my bottle because that one I like to use all the time every time I, I wash my hair or whatever I use that one because it's a little cheaper but it works pretty good too so if you want a review on that one and you want to see um, the consistency or whatever just let me know comment below and I will try and review that one I have to I have to just go pick it up because I just finished it so thank you for watching any questions concerns please down below bye